Hello friends, today we have Sridhar Bajpai with us, who is one of our course and role students and who has done very well in GATE this year. So hello Sridhar, welcome. Hello sir. Yeah, can you please introduce yourself and provide uh, some details of your educational background? Uh, so my name is Sridhar Bajpai and I, right now I'm in my final year of BTEC. Uh, okay. My college is uh, BIT Jhansi that is affiliated to State Government College of uh, Uttar Pradesh. Uh, uh -huh. I have also appeared for the gate in my third year also. In third year, I got around 900 rand. Uh, and this time in my final year, I have appeared for the Okay, great. So it was very uh, good to know that. Can you stay, share your preparation strategy in which month you have started preparing for gate? And on average, how many hours you used to put in daily? Uh, like I told you, I've started early, like uh, in the starting of my third year. Okay. Uh, because the first two months, I was only doing uh, competitive programming and taking parts in projects, and I was becoming a better problem solver. But in okay. my third year, I started for the gate. And uh, and uh, if I say about the uh, in which month I have completed the uh, syllabus, uh, that will be around August to September. September. Okay. And, by September. Uh, by September, you have completed one round of every subject. Yes, yes, perfect. Okay. Yeah, carry ahead. Uh, and uh, the you asked about the how many hours I put up in every yeah. day. So I will say around six to seven hours, I guess. There was also cheat days like on weekends. I didn't use to study anything. But Monday to uh, Saturday, six to seven hours. Okay. Okay, great. Uh, so since you mentioned that you have attempted this uh, exam for the second time, so what are the things you feel that you sh like you did not do last year and you did it this year? I mean, so what is the thing you have done differently this year? So which has made the difference for you? Okay. So I'm asking this question because there are many students. Like I will say that most... Yeah, yeah carry on. Yeah, so... Yeah, in my uh, third year when I was preparing, I didn't focus too much on the mathematics part. Okay. But uh, this year I'm uh, well prepared for the math part from not only from the PYQs of the gate, but also the PYQs of PIFR, ISI and CMI. Because these colleges are very good in mathematics and their PYQs are very relevant for the gate, gate pers perspective. Okay. So do, mm -hmm. not, uh, do not think gate is uh, math is very easy in gate. Just... Uh, do okay. good with math also, along with other subjects. Okay. So uh, coming to uh, the problem solving part, which you are trying to focus, and especially uh, in your case, it was mathematics. So after you have completed one iteration of all the syllabus, so how, how have you spent your time? So after August or September, so how you have spent your time giving the test okay. series or full length test? So uh, can you please suggest like how to the students who are coming in the, in the coming batches. So how you have spent your time? Like when I started for, like when I started for the first subject, like TOC or compiler design was my first subject, which I started with. So after mm -hmm. completing two or three subjects, I again, uh, I used to revise in round robin manner, basically. Like completing okay. two, three subjects and, th and then again completing the next two, three subjects and then coming back to the previous subjects, which I have done before. Okay. That was my to the test series. So how you have uh, uh, planned and corrected yourself in the test series? The particular questions which you are you, you have attempted unattempted or the questions which have come wrong for you. So how you used to approach those, analyze and correct your mistakes? Like whenever I was I used to attempt test series, the major uh, drawback with me was I used to do so many silly mistakes. Like I used to forgot uh, I used. In the first two hours, I have a full attention of uh, giving exam, but in the last hour, I was totally exhausted. So I improved this thing that your focus should not uh, lose. That's how I... Uh, and I also made a book for writing down my silly mistakes. Okay. So that has helped you. So, yeah. Is, uh, is there anything you would like to share with the future students, like the people who are preparing for GATE? And uh, uh, if I put this question another way, so is there anything like you would like to change in your preparation strategy uh, going back in time? Uh, uh, yes, definitely. I told you in my third year, I didn't focus too much on the mathematics part. And yeah. 
didn't solve too much questions so basically i will change that of course and, and if you are in my in first year or in second year i will say do not just start preparing for gate at for computer science first uh, do problem solving do competitive mm -hmm. programming make projects take part in hackathon whatever you can do and from third year itself you can start preparing for the gate because then you will be the perfect candidate to get uh, to do good in gate okay so you suggest that that's what i think uh, uh invest your time in problem solving as well so that you have good idea and you develop that problem solving aptitude yes. yeah yeah it's quite true yes, that because in, in the gate exam you need not you will not actually get the same questions in fact you need to apply the concepts yes. and solve the new questions thanks for your time right. and yeah. is there anything uh, you would like to suggest for gate applied course or like any feedback you have to share or any questions you have uh right now i don't have any questions but definitely you guys are doing very great and keep improving yeah thanks thanks for your time